Plants are multicellular organisms. The many cells within multicellular organisms must interact and communicate with each other. A plant's cells must share nutrients, oxygen, carbon dioxide, salts, and water. In animal cells, chemical compounds can travel across the cell membrane in a variety of ways. However, in plants, the middle lamellae and cell walls prevent chemical compounds from traveling across. So how do plant cells interact with each other? Plant cells interact and communicate with each other in two ways. By secreting messenger compounds to surrounding cells and by direct connections between cells through plasmodesmata. Plasmodesmata are small holes or channels that allow chemical compounds to travel between plant cells. Plasmodesmata exist by themselves and also in clusters named primary pit fields. The plasma membrane passes through the plasmodesmata, forming one membrane throughout the entire plant. Cytosol and parts of the endoplasmic reticulum also pass through it. Because of plasmodesmata, all of the stuff in all of the cells of a plant, the protoplasm, is one big mass called the symplast. In contrast, the cytoplasm of animal cells are separated by the plasma cell membrane. In many parts of the plant, there are spaces in between the cells called intercellular spaces. The intercellular spaces allow gases like oxygen and carbon dioxide to diffuse through rapidly. The intercellular spaces plus the cell walls make up the apoplast. A plant is made of the apoplast and the symplast together.